What if I make everything dark? Ah. Well, how about that? So I just need to get down there. And charge along. Nope, there's nothing near me. There needs to be a path anyway. Let's see, which is the best cycle to start on? Because it doesn't really matter. Just need to try. Hurt. Whew, okay. Puzzle solved. I found a skull key. Completely unexpected to find a skull key. Is there anything on the ground? Thought there was something over here. Yeah, there's a box of ammo. Woo. Hey, not a scratch. Yeah, there could ah, uh, there could be a secret down there. I guess I could check. Uh-oh. Damn it. Damn you, Shrike. I'm gonna say there isn't one. Uh oh. No. I was fine until I listened to Shrike. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, that's really cool. It was speeding up with the passage of time. Gotta wait for it to get a little closer. Am I in one? No. My light was messing me up. Oh. Damn it. I hit a button. Something happened. should actually turn off my light. What is the darkness spell? I think I have it. Two from the bottom. Oh, but then if I don't... Because eh. I need it to be able to see the walls. Ah, this is what it did. Well, thank you, Shrike. You hurt me badly, but you led me to a secret. Fire Torque. 50 fire. And a Fire Blade. That seems neat. 
Hit 24 strength. Uh, it's all fire damage, though. So, let's see. If that was doubled, it would be 16 to 48. Still not as good as this. So, I guess she'll handle it. Yeah, she could actually use it. The devs are dicks, but they're smart dicks. Well, she needs to eat something anyway. Just keep that on her. He's doing all right. There we are. And yeah, we have the last uh, skull key. The question is, do we want to save before we fight this boss? Or after we fight the boss? Because we're about to fight something, I'm pretty sure. Because then we're going to get that power gem. Uh, we'll probably be okay. We've had some bad situations already today, but... Hmm... Oh yeah, his current bracelet gives him protection and accuracy. The 50 fire would be actually quite good for the uh for the pyramid or make him immune to fire damage Yeah, fuck it. Let's see if this is a boss fight. It sure is. Okay, let's see if we can take him out before the others show up. Oh. Fuck. Oh, not this shit again. What's with these guys in Zambos? Are you gonna are you gonna show up? Nope, can't get out of that. All right, this is where I stand. Just gonna let him try to take the brunt. I can't help it. Yeah, that's not so bad. That was actually fine. Even getting cornered him by him wasn't like the worst thing in the world. Whoop! No, I got no. Got cornered again. Pseudo cornered. Destroy them all. I'm trying. Yeah, she can't dual wield any light weapons yet. Or can she? Level 5 has dual wield any light weapons. Hey. Didn't know you were back there. Okay, a lot of locked chests. Potion of willpower. Thank you. Brace of fortitude. Health regenerate plus 20%. Mmm. 
As much as I want that accuracy, I don't know. Shit. So what's he get? He gets 3 protection and 10 accuracy. Him hitting is more important than him healing quickly. I think. But I can, if I can remember, I can put this on him before he goes to sleep. Man, a lot of micro I can fucking manage to do, huh? Okay, I think that's the end of the crypt. Ah, that's the way out. Gotcha. Let's see, did this guy drop anything over here now? Oh, I didn't even check what he dropped, did I? He just dropped two swords, that's all. Nothing impressive from him. Oh, let's see, do I use this save, or do I save it for, ah, for later? Can't even see the square for some reason. It's strange. We got the ice beneath thing. You may have been frying bacon. Uh, we found a statue that was a ice elemental because they do the ice beneath spell. So we put that in the slot. We got a tome of in uh, a tome that increased Ma's uh, cold resistance by twenty permanently. So it's pretty good. Pretty good reward there. Okay. So if we say we're done here, we still haven't found the lock for the lexicanary. We still haven't finished a lot in the lexicanary, though. Like, we didn't figure out the rest of the puzzle on the archive. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to get anything more from it, to be honest. Considering... This save point has a exit to the top, like right here. We're not going to use it just yet. Just going to put some extra ones around it. Because if we go up, this one's been used. So, did that. Oops. <laughs> Sewers room. Check the respawns. We should check the respawns now, actually, because it's been almost two hours. Oh, damn, I want that gold key we saw, though. That'd be really nice if we could just pluck it out of the fucking cage. I'm beginning to think we can't get all the gold key. I don't think there are enough gold keys in the game, unfortunately. Can't believe this one's still good. Also, we have some minor puzzles, minor riddles to solve. We have the fountain with an ancient oak by its side. And we have a tree that is the loneliest of all trees. This might be in the desert. Might be in the desert. So I'm not going to worry too much about that one. That one is st starting to sound a little familiar. She needs to heal. But... We can find a fountain with an ancient oak. We should at least try anyway. Now, if we had been smart, we would have marked down all the locations of fountains. Because, you know, we expected to need to know that. What's this? Uh, the Forgotten River? Let's take a look. Now, this is probably just elementals in here. I don't remember any fountains. There's... Oh, wait a minute. We can see the fountains on our map. They actually do show up. Uh, we said this one was... An... Whoops. Not good. There's a fountain over here. And I think that's it for fountains. So let's get over to uh, Stormbreach. Let's go to the hub 
And from there we can just explore. Well, we can go to the forest first, actually. And then into uh, the original beach, and then from there we'll go to the hub and spread. Because if we're lucky, we'll get some wargs. Or wargs. How's our luck? Oh, it's looking good. And I think I saw one in the other direction as well. Just wanted to check this way first. Yeah. I need to drop some shit off. Is that the only one? And it's amazing how they keep breeding, despite them all being dead. Yeah, nothing over here. Nope. Oh, it's a twig. Maybe Dex is just bad against undead? Because she's doing way more damage against these guys. Maybe it's because they're armored. I don't know. I'm not a professional at this game. I'm just a masochist, apparently. Okay, any turtles? I'll check over that way last. Nothing, huh? Okay. Did I fucking seriously walk by this guy? Also, damn, Pa. Calm down. Oh, she was wearing the wrong necklace. <laughs> I'm actually overloaded. Damn. As much as I want her to use this weapon, I don't think it's going to work. Because she can't dual wield. Currently. Yeah. They don't tend to go past that point, from what we've seen. Still don't know what to do with this yet. Uh, let's see. He's got a bunch of bullshit. Well, doesn't need this anymore. Doesn't, ah, uh, it's really hard to tell. The helmet would give him a lot more protection, but we really like him hitting hard. I think that's more important. Uh, we want to keep the poison bracer. We don't care about the gloves. Don't care about that. Don't care about that. The regen is like a temporary kind of thing. This is supposed to be the food bag also. So maybe we should just drop these all over the floor. Or like over here. Look at all our shinies. Just put them on display. Uh, do we need a lightning rod? I already have something that does lightning. We'll keep it over here. Oh, is that a second one? <laughs> These are both the fucking same. Serpent staff gets us gets us into the pyramid, so it may be used again in the pyramid. 
write that in there. All right, there's no room. Inventory management. And we could use a couple of extra potions. For each. I think we also need to... Well, the thing is I want him to be able to use the special on his axe. Because it, it's called Devastate and that's amazing. But if we get him to Alchemy 5, or actually... Oh, only Alchemy 4. He'll get better healing and uh, energy potions. So maybe we'll just take one more level for that. Fucking Wilson. Okay, let's see. We're at the beach. Uh, I, yeah, we can check the bog. I hate being here, but... If there's frogs, there's frogs. Come on, guys. Oh, they went through the teleporter. That's weird. I didn't think enemies uh, voluntarily went through teleporters. That's some good cheap XP, except it doesn't work for us. No frogs, though. Alright, nothing here, it seems. I'm glad our heroes are okay with getting wet, like completely soaked to the bone, and then just fighting more. Not even slowing down. Okay, this is probably the... Uh, the secret. Ancient oak right side, from the oak. Take four steps to the east. So that's east. Hmm. From the oak, oops, from the oak, take four steps to the east. What is it over here? Unless this is the oak. This doesn't look ancient though. But one, no, and I can't even walk four steps. Oh shit, Ma's hungry already. Because I can do one, two, three, four, one, two. And then try digging. Nope. So this might not be the, uh, the right fountain. And that's not the right fountain, because there's definitely not enough room. And we haven't seen any more fountains. Oh, we're supposed to look at the, where the silent one looks at night. So... I guess we better hurry while it's still night. And you know what? I'm just going to put this down for now. And the poison bombs. If we're going to the fucking pyramid, the poison's not going to help. Yeah. I don't know if we're going to make it in time.
Oops. A little too quick. Okay, where's that silent one looking? All right, we'll be patient. We'll see what happens. Oh, hey. Little leprechaun.